Hello and welcome to Tada Internet Cooking Network. Today I have a very special friend with me, Tila Belfry. She also has her own catering company called Tada Catering. Today we're going to talk a little bit about comfort foods and with the holidays coming up, I think Tila can give us some great twists on some old dishes. So let's um, discuss pumpkins. How's that? Okay, we could talk about pumpkins. <laughs> Fantastic. Um, pumpkins traditionally are always just carved. You know, kids come in, they get to have fun. They, you know, make little jack-o'-lanterns, little crazy stuff. They have templates to cut out things. And that's great, but there's also other uses for pumpkins that a lot of people just don't know what to do with them. They just discard the seeds or they throw the pumpkin out or whatever. Hmm. Well, there's great uses for pumpkins in many different ways. One of the fun ways to do it with kids is you separate the pulp from the seeds on the inside, lay the seeds out on a baking sheet, sprinkle some salt, preheat the oven 350, put it in for about 10 minutes, and then you've got some great snacks. You can have alterations to that if you want to have sweet ones, put some sugar, let the sugar caramelize. You could drizzle it with chocolate if you wanted to do that, have chocolate pumpkin seeds. There's a number of things that you could do with them. And the pumpkin itself can be transformed into soups, which are great during the winter months. Wow, you covered a lot of area. <laughs> There's a lot and, to cover with the pumpkin. Yes, in, in just a short time. You know, I was thinking about maybe a pumpkin mousse, um, pumpkin bread, or even a take on a pumpkin pie, and then you can use the seeds to sprinkle over mm -hmm. the top, or even a pumpkin brittle. You know, mm -hmm. let, let's try yeah. some of these things out. Um, there's a couple of other things I think that we need to look at as well as the pumpkin. I mean, as far as with Thanksgiving coming up, the jack o' lanterns for um, for Halloween, mm -hmm. and then you've got so many varieties of pumpkins that are coming in season now, and it's just so much that you can do with the pumpkin. Also, I'm looking at probably a nice chicken and dumpling dish. Oh, okay. Ah, yes, yes, yes. Um, we're going to demonstrate how to make the dumplings from scratch and even Tila is going to be gracious enough to show you the proper procedure on making chicken stock. So those dumplings with the chicken is going to have all those lush flavors in it. Let's go ahead and go in the kitchen and try these dishes out. Again, we're in work mode, so why not? Let's why not? try these dishes out. Let's okay? do it. Okay. okay. 